Up for hip hop and R&B. Good morning to you, Chicago. Myself, Kyle, Kendra G, Leon Rogers in studio. Jesse Smollett hanging out with us this morning. Good morning, brother. Up, fam, bam, fam, yeah. bam, fam, bam, bam. Listen, man. As much as we've seen you around the city, ran into you here and there, man. This is your first time actually on the Chicago Morning Takeover, man. I'm very excited. Welcome to the show. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you. So slow rise, yeah. class. Slow rise class. <laughs> you know what I love so much? Cause I remember like the first year, it was always like. Jesse Smollett, BK, Jamal Lyon from mm -hmm. Empire. But we don't have to follow it with the Jamal Lyon nah. anymore. Like, people, when we say your name, everybody knows what we talking That's about. That's dope. I appreciate that. Because you used to be like, my mama named me Jesse. I love, I mean, one time you went off. But no, I don't go <laughs> off, but it was a thing. Like, in the beginning, here's the thing. Still to this day, if fans say say Jamal, like, that's respect. You know what I'm saying? Like, right. I don't, I don't, I, that doesn't bother me. You know what I'm right. saying? Because that's just, that's what they know me as right That's now. how they relate. Yeah, 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 exactly. And it's like, it's just about paying dues and whatnot. But but it's like sometimes people would be. I remember I did an interview one time, and this homegirl she she kept on calling me Jamal, <laughs> and I was like, um, "Can I see you?" What is this? Right. Like, what's good? What's good? What's good? <laughs> um, but yeah, that's 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 what it is. It's it's all it's all love. I mean, it's it's. I certainly don't feel anything except gratitude for any, nice. everything yeah. that Empire has done for me. Yeah, right. No yeah, doubt. Yeah. No doubt. Yeah. But my name is Jesse, and my mama's name ain't Cookie. <laughs> <laughs> my mama's name is Janet. No, but but your mother not. But in a good way, she's very, very strong like Cookie in real Absolutely. life. Absolutely. I always say that my mother is like a cross between Cookie Lion and Fraulein Maria from The Sound of Music. Yeah. Because she's just like always singing and always you know was always doing that our whole lives. But she also so it was very, very stern. Can she don't you, take nothing. Can right. you break down the Fraulein Maria from Sound of Music? Because a lot of the homies. All right, let like, me break this down. What are you talking about, Joe? Talk about the hood. Talk to us the hood. Yeah, way. yeah. Y'all want to be in the hood. hood. The hood knows. What about Diana Ross? The, the, the hood knows. The hood knows. The hood knows. It would be, it would be Cookie Lion and, you know what? Let me say Cookie Lion and Mary Poppins because black people know no, Mary Poppins. No, Mary Poppins. Yeah, right. You know Mary Poppins. You're like, yeah, bro. Just a spoonful of sugar. I like that. I don't know if they know about that. My mama made me watch it, bro. <laughs> y'all better get hip to the song and get your entire life, yo. See, y'all better in the grass on, fields, now. baby. See, so, this is how we do when we're alone. <laughs> <laughs> Jesse is here in Chicago. We're going to talk about a lot. Uh, a big thing for you is the fact that you dropped this single last yeah, night, yes? Yeah, yeah. I ain't slept, y'all. I yeah. keep saying I was like a child at Christmas. I kept on going online and being like, what they think? <laughs> <laughs> they like it? They think? So, so you, yeah. you see him doing this thing, obviously, on Empire, but we're going to come back and we're going to talk about his musical career as well. So 312-591-1075, hit us up. Jesse Smollett hanging out in the building. And uh, now is a big star, man, this, you know, this song's kind of appropriate for celebrities. We're going to take it back with Tupac. <laughs> I get around. Oh, oh my, my God. God. <laughs> Yo, wait, play it. Play it. Play it. Hey, because I'm on live. Let's get it. About to rap. 1075 GCI, the shot's number one for hip hop and RB Chicago. You missed it. Jesse Smollett rapping. I was killing it. Along to Tupac, I get around the money B part. I was killing it. Yeah, you was doing your thing. Man. You, you, you did I a mean, good job. I mean, you know, I mean, you sound a little like not certain though, kid. No, you? I mean, listen, you did a good job because you did the lyrics to the song. I thought you was going to freestyle your own joint because that's what I do. I make up rhymes. First, like, I get a. Uh, but oh, you gonna freestyle? Yeah. No, 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 no,
or if a hundred people were listening, you should say something worth hearing. You know responsibility. What, responsibility. Yeah. responsibility. Yeah, yeah, and, we're, yeah. we're, and I have no problem with taking that responsibility. And we're in a time right now where um, we're we're kind of overwhelmed with party music. You know what I'm saying? Oh, okay. And, you know what I mean? So for you to do that and maybe help contribute to bringing some of that balance yeah. back. Because these artists that you mentioned were all very socially relevant artists. And the fact that their music was so socially relevant at the time, it stands the test of time. It stand, it's the, that's all I wanted to do. When I set out to make this record, I, the whole album, I was just like... They, they were like, oh, what do you want to do? It's got to be groundbreaking. I was like, I just want to make a timeless record. That matters. Right. I just want to make that a matters. Right. Something, that, something that matters and, and just a timeless record. That's groundbreaking yeah. to me. Listen, I, I catch a lot of flack for it sometimes because I say I don't care about everybody else. I care about <clears> us. <throat> like, I noticed you have a sweatshirt on that says King. Gabby so, gave it to me. So, so, of course, so, so, of course, I feel like when you're writing music or something, you come from that aspect to, to kind of be like, yo, I'm giving a message to my people too. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Because yeah. at the end of the day, I don't really care what nobody else do. I care about us. And that may sound selfish. I don't think that that sounds selfish. But, but, I, think that, I think that that's how we're going to win. We're in such a predicament. We're in such a situation, the, the entire nation. But I'm talking about us as a people because we at times tend to forget about ourselves. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I feel like females forget about themselves. You know what I'm saying? And you can't, it's okay to celebrate who we are. You know what I'm saying? And that takes nothing away from anybody else. Right. But it ain't about you right now. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. It's all love, spread love. It's the Brooklyn way. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay for us to acknowledge the love and the community that we have within each other. And if the second that we forget that, we fail to we exist. Lost. You know. I was going to just say real quick, you know, because um, Empire shoots in Chicago, so that's one of the reasons. That is the reason why Jesse Smollett is in Chicago. But when things happen in the city, I have seen you out there protesting with the things that are actually affecting Chicago in itself. And that's why I love so much about you, because you use your platform in all the right ways. Yeah. Thank you. You, Thank you, you really do. You bring awareness to, you, you use your energy to bring awareness to things that people need to talk about. And that's why you're going to be so successful. Thank you no very doubt. much. No doubt. All right, so look, we're going to get ready, because we do want to come back, and we do want to let people We'll hear uh, some of the music. Yeah. And I also want to talk to you about... Ah, that was kind of like the album. <laughs> some of my music. Okay. Okay. Because that's the title of the album. Okay. Uh, so we're going to let people check that out. And I do want to talk to you about Thurgood, uh, Thurgood Marshall and Langston Hughes, the yeah, character yeah, you yeah. play, and some of the other stuff as well. All yeah. right? Jesse Smola hanging out with us in the studio right now. His that's crew. good. Chicago, you're hearing it first right now on 107.5 WGCI. Yes, Jesse Smollett's new single just dropped last night called Freedom off the upcoming album, his debut album, hitting stores March Inspirational, man. Yeah, man. Inspirational. Yeah, so, so give us a brief synopsis of uh, Freedom and, and the basis behind the music. It's just a song about love. You know what I'm saying? But like the purest, most wonderful, honest, and genuine love that you could imagine. No matter who it's between, even if it's like your your love your love your lover your your family yourself your community you know what I'm saying it's just like that the understanding emotion. yeah, yeah. That, that the 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 that feeling of like damn you know me at my stripped down like my rawest and and still you love me and that's to me is freedom I feel like we have that as a community I feel like we have that I have that with my family I have that with my love like that's what that's what freedom is to me when you wrote that song did you write it with a certain group of people in mind like this was written this song was brought with... to me. This okay. song was brought to me. And okay. that's the thing, like, the songs have to mean something to me. And and it was brought to me by one of my dear friends, Brian Terrell Clark, who is one of the stars of Hamilton. And he nice. he um he was here in Chicago and he was playing me a bunch of songs for my album and he played this one and then he played other songs and I was just like, Can we go back to that one? <laughs> and he was like, Yeah, 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 but I got other ones. I was like, but can cool. we go back to that one? That one got you. And I was just like, I every single time that it hits a certain part, I get emotional. And it's, I was saying, I, I performed it in, in South Africa, and I cried through the whole thing. Because it's just, it's that, for me, it's that song. It means a lot. It I means think, a lot. I think anyone can sing a song, anyone can make a song, but not everyone can make you feel a certain way from a song. And I remember, I was blessed enough to be on the set of Empire when you did the song Mama for oh, a cookie. Yeah. And then, like, what people don't realize is they go through these takes so many times. You got to do different angles. So, like, you sang the song so many different times, but because I lost my mom, mm -hmm. I was like, keep doing it, keep doing and I remember I was like you know what I know they had you sing that song so many times but just know you affected my life so that. much because nice. when you performed it I could tell you weren't just singing the words you were really singing it like you meant it and that's what this song freedom does too you. like you, nice. your, your emotions transition 
through the music, Thank and you. we can feel you from that. That's Thank what I you. love I about hope so. you. Good I hope job, so. man. Thank you very much, y'all. So let's take this break. We got to take a break. Jesse Smell is still hanging out with us. He's not going nowhere in yeah. Chicago, uh, so don't move. We got to find out more about what's going on in this I want to ask him, do you have any songs about freaking on his ass? <laughs> yeah. The freaking song. Yeah. 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 Get on that. Yeah. Yeah. I'm with the freak. Yeah. 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 Bitch. Pan is over. Uh, that's why I'm like, it ain't no inspirational album. That's funny. I, I want to Airbnb his apartment when he leaves yeah. when he leaves Chicago. I want to Airbnb the party. Pan is over. All right, also, <laughs> Chicago, don't forget, we got your chance at $1,000 16 times a day. Make sure you tune in for that. Stick around for your shot at that. And we're coming back with the kid in the show in traffic as well, man. It's GCI. Don't move. 107.5 GCI, the shot is number one for hip-hop and R&B. Kyle, Kendra G, Leon Rogers, we're in the building, man, Jesse Smollett, hanging out with us, man. If you just tuned in, you missed the fact that we got a chance to hear his new single, just dropped last night, Freedom. But it's all good, because they can download and stream it. <laughs> there you right. go. It's all good. Okay. There you missed go. it. If you missed it, you could download and stream it. If you didn't miss it, you could download and stream That's it. That's right. <laughs> it, it actually, it takes nothing to stream it. You can stream it for free. Yeah. Pretty much, right? So and I heard title is free. Uh, yeah, title is on free. A, on a, a, uh, they're going on a little trial basis right now. Yeah. yeah. Okay, yeah. so yeah. it's on yeah. iTunes, Title. It's everywhere. Everywhere, okay. It's everywhere. I think tomorrow it should be, either today or tomorrow, it should be on like everything like Google Play and everything like that. Because I don't know if it hit, like this, some Samsung people were hitting me up being like, uh, what's good, bro? Okay. Right. <laughs> I'm like, listen. Right. Listen. Yeah, they need to Google Play. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah so yeah. it's called Freedom. Yeah. Right now, go to your phone and you download it and stream it. The CD is out, though. March, March 2nd. March yeah. 2nd. Yeah. I said yeah. CD. Like, but the, the, I mean, it's, uh, to me, it's a CD. Is it CD? Okay. But okay. then February, we're going to drop the second season, the second uh, the second single which is a song with Swiss Beats okay and then the third Woo! one is and I directed that video and then the uh, and then the third one is called Hurt People and it's I directed that video that we did in South is Africa is it Swiss nice. Beats produced yeah yeah yeah. Ooh. Nice. <laughs> I know the beat is this is crazy. nice. <laughs> this is nothing like freedom. This is like on some old school, like Mary J. Method Man. Ooh. 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 Ooh, that sounds crazy. Oh, when it says yeah. Swiss beats, I yeah, 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 know. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, Swiss came through on that. Let me switch gears really quick, if you don't mind, because I wanted to ask you about um, the movies. You know what I'm saying? You've been very active outside of television and Empire, and I think the last thing I saw you in was Marshall. Um, and yeah, it was a quick role in there, but mm -hmm. you played Langston Hughes. Yeah. But it's an important role yeah, in that film. So. And I also read that you're actually uh, thinking about doing a biopic for Langston Hughes. Is yeah, when Reggie Hudlin, the great Reginald Hudlin, uh, when he came to me at the Image Awards, I was performing there a tribute to John Legend. Mm -hmm. And he was producing it, and he came up to me, he's like, yo, you look so much like Langston Hughes. Can you, um, would you come and play him? And I was like, uh, first of all, my middle name is Langston. Mm -hmm. And wow. I was like... I was like, yeah, on one condition that you tell me that we're going to within the next three years do the Langston Hughes story. And he said, done. So mm. I, I did it. And then, um, so hopefully we got two years left before I sue that nigga. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see. <laughs> prepare, for, prepare for a role like that, though. How much do you have to deeply immerse yourself into Langston Hughes, and how hard is that when you're also simultaneously working on the set of like? Empire? Well, that's the thing. I was not working on Empire okay. at the time, so I was able to. I had gone straight from doing Alien in uh, in okay. Australia, and then I came to Buffalo. But before I went to Buffalo, I went to Harlem, and I literally just sat on the steps of Hughes House, mm. and then I became close to the owner of Hughes House, and I spent time in there. Like I was able to touch his typewriter I was able to touch his pictures and his things and just feel his vibe and really just trying to listen to his um, I went through a lot of YouTube uh, a lot of YouTube videos of him reading his own poetry mm. so I could kind of get that low slow uh, speaking voice you know yeah. what I'm saying and and you know I think that the when I do it fully it'll be even better so you know I have That's time to immerse right. into it so let's talk Empire. Now, yeah, okay, a couple of things. So, you, it's Juice here in Chicago, so you don't give us all your, your key spots, but mm -hmm. we know you basically live in Chicago, so where do you be yeah. at when you're in the city? Um, I love, can I keep it real? I love this little spot called Dublin. Oh, I was like, it's still, it's still Dublin? It's still Dublin. Dublin's downtown, yes. It's, it's, it's a little pub. No, it's so good. It's though. just chill, and I think it's 24 hours or it's open until like 4 or something like that, but it's just old reliable, and I order the same thing. Right. Like, <laughs> but like the same thing every single time, and it's just, it, you know, we stayed at the Thompson Hotel when we were doing the uh, the pilot, so I fell in love with that whole area that everybody calls Viagra Triangle, which I didn't know that. <laughs> <laughs> like you see a bunch of old rich dudes walking with these sexy, beautiful young women, and I'm like, I'm like, Kendra, I better not never see your ass walking around there. 
jumping out of Bentley or something. Ever. You know what I mean? Wait, they're coming, out, they're coming out of the Bentleys? Oh, uh, I'm that's, you, 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 you win down there, Kenzie. See? Yeah. See? Oh, look I'm at done. this little chocolate thing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no, no, I love I love Dublin's, but I don't. I usually hang out at my house. You know, I'm, I I cook a lot. Okay. So people will come over to my house. You know, like yeah, people yeah. will come over. And to And they my do house other and, things when they come over to your yeah. house. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but I made a New Year's. Hold on, man. Wait, 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 wait. What does that mean? She made it sound like you have a swingers. No, 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 Wow, that's your wild boy. It's legal in California. (laughs) (laughs) But how much is he showing people his head? (laughs) (laughs) I hate Leah. Wow, wow. Wow. How many more seasons do we have with um, Empire? Talk about Black Ink Crew. Hopefully, at least two, so that we can get our syndication. Okay. So we'll see. Yes. (laughs) You know what I'm saying? We'll see. I love y'all though, man. Yeah. For the support, I really appreciate it. No, we love you too. The CD, the song is called Freedom. We want everybody in Chicago to download it, stream it. You have no excuse. Go to your phone right now. That's just spell that with Freedom. That's right. It's Friday. You ain't got nothing to do. Yep. Go ahead, listen That's to the right. song. <laughs> Freedom okay. Freeze. We, we wish you uh, continued success. Yes, and I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back yeah, yeah, when the actual album drops. Because yeah. 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 it took you too long to get up here yeah. on the morning show anyway. We know I was trying to so save it until man. I had something of yeah. my own to talk about. Yeah, that <laughs> makes sense. So I'm honored. I'm and happy. How do you no keep doubt. your hair so curly? I wash and condition that sucker. Oh, you got hair like that? No, I mean, that you, you, know, you know, that's, no, that's, that's in that ass. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Chicago, Jesse Smollett, and you know, with us, man. No mind to Luther the King. Congratulations on everything, brother, Thank and you, we'll see you when you come no back. Yeah. Yes. Thank yes. you so much. Let's Love go ahead and get into this music, man. Here's Kerry Hilson, Kanye West, Neo, Knock You Down. Oh, take it back. <laughs> <laughs>